Hello, Z Bird. Welcome back to Plants for Zombies Battle for Neighborville. Today, we are going to go into the prize map for Summer Nights and finally finish it off. We're unlocking the brand new Super Brains ability and, of course, his legendary outfit we'll be checking out. So, this is the new ability Brainium Basher 9001. Swap primary and secondary weapon for a charge up dash attack and an upward strike, which is very cool. That's going to be 20 of the prize bulbs. Um, and also, that means we get um, the metal head for free. But that is the legendary um, costume we'll be checking out today. Metalhead, his favorite bands are Iron Laden, Metallic Ish, and Mega Breath. So let's go ahead and get that for free. And then that should complete the Summer Nights thing. So that's cool. And that, of course, also means since we've gotten the prize map completed, we unlock the other legendary costume for the Super Brains, the Midas Tough. Everything he touches turns to goldfish, which is fine, I guess. Anyways, let's go ahead and switch over and we'll sort of see how things go. Um. Yeah, so Super Brains is right over this way. We'll go ahead and use, not the Midas Tough, but the Metal Head right here, which I do think is very cool. Of course, has sort of like a steampunk gear kind of theme to it, as you can see with all the steel and the, and the shoulder blades are like a gear. And same thing with this really cool cape. I like that for sure. And then also, if we want to go over this way, I might just unequip everything for right now um, so that we can find out where the legendary ability is because those usually take up a lot of slots and I don't know how that's exactly going to work. So, Branium Basher 9001, swap primary and secondary weapon for a charge up dash attack. Um, so, we can't have something like Vampiric. We only have two more slots. So, I could do Fearless. Um, might be worth considering. Uh, but yeah, let, let's try this out. I'm a little curious to see how this goes. Um, because it changes our primary weapon, as you can see. And we can just charge, and we can cancel it, too. Oh, interesting. Oh, So I guess when it's purple like that, that's when it's fully charged, and we just sort of storm in. That's really fascinating. So we'll have to try that out a little bit and see how it goes in some turf takeover. All right, so let's get into it. We're stopping the payload here. Um, and I'm excited to just give this a try. I've been seeing plenty of Super Brains beat me up with it. I'm just happy to give it a go myself. And oh, I totally missed. I'm definitely interested to see how this goes. I definitely think it's going to take some time to get used to, for sure. Um, but so far, all of the legendary upgrades have been pretty powerful. The Colonel Corn one was strong. The Rose one was strong. A lot of people argue that the Scientist one was just straight up overpowered. So I'm interested to see if the Super Brains one will be as ridiculous, <laughs> either in a good way or in a bad way. I guess we'll find out. But I'm just going to charge in and totally miss everybody again. That is really something I need to figure out. Oh my gosh, that is so weird. Because you can't, like you gotta really predict where they're gonna be. <laughs> that is so weird. All right, well you're running away. The game is so laggy. Uh, that is not helping me at all. Okay, that time I got you and it did 90 damage, wow. Um, the only issue is that unless you're like really able to follow through, I don't know how I'm still alive right now, by the way. Uh, oh, <laughs> yikes. That's fine, was expecting that. But let's just keep it going. Um, seems like we have three minutes left to defend, but they're pushing in pretty quickly here. So, I mean, I'm expecting that maybe the first couple rounds of this not to go super well as we figure out how in the world we use this thing. I see this Chronicorn. And I just, I ran right into his shield. So it's just, okay, that wasn't too bad. <laughs> it seems like you almost want to be sneaking in. Weird, so weird. I feel like this might be one of those things, and we'll have to wait and see, where it's a difficult to master thing, but once you do figure it out, it, it's maybe very easy, or just like very, at least, effective. Where did that Snapdragon go? I do not know. I'm going for the weed. <laughs> maybe I shouldn't have. Oh, oh, I hit the banner there. Oh, I got somebody with the uh, slam. That's nice, at least. Oh. Okay, I just tried to do a quick and simple one. Like, I just pressed the button real fast. And that sort of kind of worked. You know, better than nothing. Well, I'm definitely getting vanquished quite a lot right now. And that's okay. Uh, but yeah, I really like this outfit. The outfit's a little bulky with, you know, the big tank on his back. So I feel like that makes Super Brains an even bigger target. Easier to spot and everything. But I don't think, you know, being easy to spot is really too much of Super Brains' worry for the most part. Okay, I do think that the servers being laggy makes it more difficult because, you know, like I'm trying to aim up and that's exactly when the game is gonna start skipping, of course. Uh, but we'll keep trying. And we'll see what's going on. Uh, without the hyper eel batteries, the rocket can't take off. Okay, so yeah, we, we gotta protect the batteries here. I wonder if this would be a better ability or 
weapon to use in an attack scenario instead of a defensive one. I guess we'll find out. So you don't know. I'm about to come in. Oh, but I missed him still. How embarrassing. And that's where things get tough, is that you actually need some fairly good aiming and to hope that that doesn't end up the way it did. Oh, this is really tough. Definitely the hardest one to sort of figure out out of the four. This is our fourth legendary character upgrade in Battle for Neighborville. And so far the most difficult one to figure out from the get-go. Um, because the other few were pretty easy. I mean, the Rose one was a little confusing, but once you figure it out, it's like, oh, okay. With this one, it just feels like there's definitely like a skill you need to master that's unlike some of the others. So I guess you can actually move around a little bit while you're charging. Oh, and I went right past you again. It seems like, I don't know, it's so weird. Okay, I don't know where this guy went. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, so what's going on over this way? Ooh. Oh, I got somebody, but I think they were shielded. Or maybe it was like a base speed, I don't know. Oh, that did a lot of damage. It is so hard to land, but when you do, you hit like a truck. It's crazy. Boom. I How did... What? It hit the chomper, it said 125 damage, and then it just didn't do anything. Weird. All right, well, somehow we've got the four vanquishes. I feel sort of lucky to get that much so far. But you really need to pick your battles wisely and hope that the battle you picked, you're actually able to hit them. Because <laughs> if not, it gets messy real quick. They're extending their time quite a lot. Also, why is it showing the bomb icon for the batteries? That's not right. <laughs> What's happening there? That's like a new issue. Oh, here we go. Oh! Go on, go, go again. And there's also like this like a couple of moments. Ah, oh, I was hoping I wouldn't fall like that, but here we are. Ooh, boom. Okay, I got somebody with it, that's good. Just trying to take out who I can, give him a hard time. All right, let's keep it going. Seems like it's uh, three for three when it comes to their batteries right now. So our team is at least doing a good job holding them off, and I'm happy to see that. But yeah, it is cool that we finally got up to this legendary upgrade. Like I said, I've been waiting a while for it, so just happy that even though I'm very late in the month, it's actually the last day of July I'm recording this. Um, I'm glad that we could get here, so yeah. Ah, did that get him? That didn't. Oh, <laughs> come on, it's so tough. I mean, maybe I'm doing something wrong now. Like, it, can I still pull up my shield? I don't think so, because I think it replaces the punch and the shield. Oh, there is more. Okay, I'm just being silly then, I'm being a dingus. Okay, let's try this again then. Um, I don't really, oh, you know what? I think I see then, I think I understand. Um, what I can do is, okay, like you, you're, oh, what, you're, you're gone. But you can see like the, the chomp up there, and then I can uppercut them like that. And then while I'm still doing that, I could charge up another one, interesting. All right, once again, our team is doing a great job of keeping them all back. So I can uppercut them. It sort of worked, it also sort of didn't. That's just gonna give me a whole set of things to figure out now. Weird, that is so weird. <laughs> I like it, it just, it's so weird. All right, let's get back out there. Three minutes remaining. I don't think we're gonna be able to hold off on that time. They only have one battery to deliver, but I'm going to try my best as I figure thing, things out here. Oh, okay, well, that did 50 damage to you, but apparently that's not enough. Okay, gotcha. Oh my, go for ya. That gotcha, and then the uppercut finishes you off. That's great, what I really like about it is that you do have that extra second to, oh, I'm, I'm stunned. Um, you have that extra second to um, charge while you're in the air, so you can just sort of go for it again, which is pretty cool. But it looks like they might be taking the win here. Yep, there they go. So that's fine, I needed that round to sort of figure things out anyways, so the plants win, we'll try a little harder in the next round. All right, well, let's see how things go here on the tourist trap island. I guess I'm joining a little late for this one, but that's okay, we'll just take on whoever we can. And I really don't know if it's gonna go any better this time, but I'm taking that weed out, there we go. Oh, it does a lot of damage, it's a problem. Oh, actually that wasn't too bad, we almost took out his health there, and that's an oak, so. 
definitely it's not something you want to go against a group of plants with. You you are looking to take out one, maybe two plant groups. Um, or a group of plants that is of one to two plants in size. You know what I mean. <laughs> but I think that's just going to take some extra practice and just sort of, you know, continue to be in that mindset to actually get that done. In the meantime, it, it is great to sort of, I guess, still be in a position of defending for right now because of that. But I just have to remember that I can move around a little bit while I'm charging. Boom. There we go. Uppercut, uppercut. That, I did not mean to press that. I pressed the wrong button. I mean, we, we got him, so that's good. But probably not the most effective way of doing it. And we got the Vanquish from the Grave, so... As long as I can get maybe a little bit better in terms of Vanquishes this time, I'd be happy with that. Also, just to let you guys know, between episodes, I did get some of the challenges done. I only have one set of character challenges to do with the Space Cadet, but we'll be doing them next episode, so stay tuned for that. We're almost done with the Summer Nights events. So, yeah, that'll be cool to get done. Okay, I didn't even see you. You're so small over there. All right, you're going down. Actually, where did where did he go? I guess he just zipped away there. Oh, who are we going for next? There's gotta be somebody around, right? Oh, here we go. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. All right, let's keep that going. I need to charge up again. Go for this chomper if I can, and I totally miss him. That's sort of the most painful thing is when you totally, totally miss somebody. And I probably need to be using the other Super Brain's abilities a little bit more often if I can. If I could just, you know, jump on you, probably a good idea. And then I can just upcut, uppercut you. But that didn't seem to work very well. It's, it's weird. It's really weird. Um, and that's where it just takes a lot of time. What I do appreciate about this ability so far is how much it does change up the Super Brain's play style. Uh, it doesn't feel like a whole new class by any means, but it does feel like a di different variation, almost like it's a character variant, which is really cool. I think that's, you know, all we hope for with these legendary character upgrades, and hopefully more of them do come soon. They have confirmed the next two months of events, and neither of which have legendary character upgrades, but there apparently might be two new characters in general, so it doesn't really matter too much, as long as we're getting something new, right? Whoa. Okay, um, let's jump and then just slam. Oh my, I'm in trouble. <laughs> oh, I didn't realize I was right over here. Ah, uh, just one thing after the next, it's very hard not to stumble into tr into trouble when you're using this move. But that's why I'd love to hear your thoughts. Have you been able to try this new legendary Super Brains ability from Summer Nights? Were you able to unlock it throughout the event? Or maybe you got it from Rux or anything? And what are your thoughts on it? Do you think it's a good ability? Have you been able to crack the code on it? I would love to hear your advice. Uh, but in the meantime, I'll continue to try to figure it out and give you my advice. But right now, it seems like playing it safe, trying to sort of get more used to it, it just takes time. So, you know, if you're struggling with it, don't sweat it. Go figure it out. I trust you. Anyways, boom. Oh, that did not do any damage for some reason. So they're probably about to pop around the corner and I totally missed him again. Okay, but you didn't see me. But I missed you again! Oh my gosh, you'd think with how big Super Brains is, it wouldn't be that bad to not miss people, but here I am constantly doing it. There we go. The big thing is you have to aim at where they're going, not where they are. And obviously that's easier said than done. And uh, with a bigger target, it certainly makes it easier though. Okay, uppercut. Oh, the uppercut I think helped. Oh my gosh, maybe it didn't. Boom. Okay, well, didn't do as much as I was hoping. Oh, I know you're going for me. I know you're going for me. Ah, oh, did that not, not uh, that uppercut not get him? Because it looked like it did damage, but once again, I think there might be some lag, so I might be hitting damage, but not actually hitting it. But it looks like the zombie team is doing a great job defending against us. Uh, we'll have to wait and see. Right now, it's, it's definitely looking like, oh, you guys are in trouble. Oh, maybe not. I take that back. See, that time, I, I felt like I went right through him, but like, who knows? Definitely not me. Okay, just start spinning on him. I feel like the spinning was upgraded since the game has launched. Probably, I can't remember, because it, I remember it used, used to not be so good, but it, it can secure a Vanquish now, which is pretty nice. Uh, but they are pushing into overtime. Let's see if we can't stop them. Right now, it's sort of a weird spot because we're contesting it, so the overtime's not going down, but the the capturing isn't going up. There we go. Oh, I hit somebody with it. That's all I want is just to hit somebody with it. 
Okay, okay. Super jump onto somebody. Oh, they got me good, even when I was in the air. It is so tough, for sure. And it was just an AI kernel cord. But still, it looks like neither team is budging right now. Okay, well maybe the plant team is budging forward a little bit. But come on, we can get him off of there, right? I'd hope so. I definitely want to sneak behind if I can. And this whole group, oh my gosh, that was awful. That was just awful. Okay, that wasn't too bad. I'm just trying to do that. I just, I don't know how I feel about the uppercut. I feel like, unless you're right, right next to him, like really close to them, the uppercut doesn't seem to work as well as you'd expect. And that's a bit concerning. It's pushing me the wrong way. All right. Will we be able to do this? I don't know, it looks like they're about to take it. And that's where, once again, sneaking around might be a great idea, but can I actually get it done? All right, right about there. I saw the sunflower and stuff running around. A lot of zombies are over here, actually. Ooh, we're charging. Gotcha, right? No? I don't know, that was so weird. Because it looked like, to me, we hit her, and then we just sort of kept going. And once again, that could be server lag. That could mean just not understanding something about it. Ooh, go for it. There we go. Okay, try again. Well, actually, let's just go for that. That hit somebody, apparently. I don't know if I should trust that or not at this point. Oh, I went through somebody there, so that's great. Mm, there we go, that's what I'm talking about. Keep them out of there. Come on, come on, come on. Nope, they're still on the point. Gotcha. All right, now we're starting to stack something up here. Is that what I wanted? I can't see a thing. What was going on there? I don't know. I'm just trying to give them a really hard time. There goes the rose. But they just keep pushing this overtime over and over again. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, I need to, as soon as I'm done being to go, I need to jump, I need to jump. Oh, come on, uppercut. See, I don't know if the uppercut did damage. Maybe the uppercut doesn't do damage. Maybe it just displaces them a little bit. Hard to tell. It's a mess. It's a big mess right now. This is like a really long overtime as well. If we could just keep all of them off the point for like two seconds, I'm pretty sure we'd win. But I don't know if that's gonna happen at this point. Ooh. Okay, that was maybe a bit of a mistake. Who's behind me? Apparently somebody. I don't, that's sort of the weird thing. There's so many places for them to enter, it can be hard to tell like where they even are. Ah! Oh, that was quick of you. Jeez, that acorn was good. <laughs> he just moved at the perfect exact time he needed to. Okay, come on, keep it up, team. I know we can do this. This is like a really intense battle we got going on right now. One thing I did notice I haven't mentioned, it seems like sometimes when we charge, the top of Super Brain's head sort of glows green. I don't know if that's something about this costume or if that's something more about the legendary upgrade. I guess we should keep trying and find out. Because it doesn't always happen, but sometimes I swear his head gl glows green. What happened there? Once again, you can see how I just randomly got stuck like that. I'm pretty sure that's lag. Okay, this guy's just chilling out. Oh boy, I don't know where that's coming in from. Just trying to stay away. Get the oak, get the oak. Mmm, that got the oak. Oh, they're gonna get me with that. <laughs> or not. I can't even tell what's going on right now. Ooh, charge it up, charge it up, charge it up. And maybe just go down this way. The overtime is ticking down for him. Put a stop to him. Get him off that point. No, they extended it again. Darn, it just, they will not give up. Somebody's gotta lose morale here sooner or later. <laughs> I wish I could have thrown that out. I think that would've been good. We're up to 22 vanquishes now, which is really good, much better than I was expecting for this round. Keep going. So I've definitely figured it out a little bit more. I didn't mean to do that. Uh, but I still think that there's more I could get better with here. So, I think it might just be good to first and foremost throw this out. It might not hit anybody, or it might hit that guy. So, that's why I gotta try it, right? You don't know what's gonna end up doing. I swear I went through somebody there. 
but I can't know for sure. Hmm. Get that sunflower, I totally missed her. Once again, you gotta time it so that you're hitting where they are going to be, not where they are. Oh, hi guys. If I could give him problems back here, that'd be excellent. Oh, get back here. Yeah, I got him, wow, cool. Somehow I have a times five vanquish streak right now, but if I can keep them back there for long enough, and the rest of our zombie team is keeping up, that would be good, but right now they're capturing it. There's nobody, oh, they really took it there. My gosh, I can't believe that. Well, let's see if they do the same for point three. I'll do everything I can to stop them, give them a hard time. They might have, oh, I didn't even realize, I didn't even see him. They might have gotten the, the result they were looking for for that second point, but will they be able to continue it to the third? I guess we'll have to wait and see. Because right now, I don't know, I'm feeling pretty good about this. I feel like, obviously there's some room to improve, but definitely I've already improved since the beginning. So that's nice. Yeah, as well, you know, let me know your thoughts on this ability, but also let me know your thoughts on this costume. Do you think basically all of the rewards here for um, Summer Nights have been worth it? I do like this costume. I don't think, once again, it thematically fits fits with the, uh, with the season, but that's okay. It is what it is. Um, it is interesting seeing so soon another Super Brains Legendary costume set because obviously we had one back for our first holiday event, um, which was Lawn of Doom. We had the the insect super rings. Oh my. Oh, I just barely got away from that. I mean, obviously it still did damage, but it could have been a lot worse. Let's back it up a little bit. I just want to be able to heal. Uh, and I guess I'll throw that out and hope it does something. It hit that, that oak. Awesome. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Go for this guy. Got him. And what is going on? See how his head is green there? I don't know what that's about. I guess like maybe the better we combo things is like, is that it? I don't know. Or maybe it turns green when we get a vanquish. I have no clue what's going on with that. It's not like a legendary hat, I don't think. Okay, come on, come on. Ah, oh, but I got stunned. Bad timing. Yeah, let's get out of here if I can. Oh no, 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 no. I probably shouldn't be risking this right now. Ah, oh, I got transformed to a goat. It seems like every time I hop in, something majorly deters me. Somehow they didn't attack me there though. That's nice. She still has not noticed me. All right, we're going in. Ah, oh, she dodged it, wow. Go for it, uppercut. See, it's green again. What is with that? What did I do? I don't know. There we go. Okay, maybe I'm starting to figure it out. Get this to Tron. Oh, ho, 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 ho. now you guys are in trouble. Okay. Um. I know there's an acorn attacking me. I'm going to leave at the, oh. Okay, now I gotta leave. <laughs> now I have to leave. That's crazy though. Imagine if I had enough points left over for vampire as well. That'd be really, really good. Okay, get either the garlic, oh, that can happen then. Um, I was hoping I could get the garlic turn or the pea shooter there. I got neither. But like I was saying before, it is weird that we finally, you know, we got another Super Brains ability before, or Super Brains legendary costume at the end of an event before so many other classes have had their chance to get a legendary costume. We're still waiting for one for like the oak or the soldier. So hopefully that happens soon. I'm just gonna launch that over there. It did some damage. Most of these guys just aren't paying attention to me right now, so we're just gonna go for it. Oh no, See, that one didn't do much because I just, I didn't land it. Oh my, slam, slam, got it, nice. And you're gonna get me, but I got a couple of vanquishes out of it, so I'm happy with that. And we're up to 33 now, so not the best for sure, but definitely a lot more comfortable with this than I was expecting to get in this round. So that's good. It seems like keeping it frequent, maybe not charging up all the way as often, um, might just be a better choice. See, that time it really confuses me how I didn't hit him. And that time as well, but not as much. Okay, buddy, I know you're just trying to distract me, so I'm just gonna leave you. Oh, yeah, that's not gonna be the best idea. 
I, I'm a goat now. That's happening a lot today. Hmm. Now is a great time though to sneak up on some things. Hmm. That was not really what I was intending to do there. But it's how it happened. Oh, how did uh, the rose survive that? It's just driving me nuts the times where it seems like it is hitting and then like the game sort of freezes for a second and then you slide by it. And I'm pretty sure that's just like either the server catching up or the game doing something weird. I don't know. But it makes it very hard to know if I'm doing the right thing or if the game is sort of cheating me, you know? So hopefully we can figure that out a little bit more. Maybe that's just a momentary thing. But I do really appreciate how it really, like it drastically changes the Super Brains gameplay without making it not feel like Super Brains, you know? Because I feel like, especially Battle for Neighborville Super Brains with his shield um, and how his shield works in Battle for Neighborville, I, I think that he really encourages a lot of sort of slow paced gameplay and sort of being a bit careful, choosing that time to jump in. And I feel like that is the same for this ability or this way with the primary weapon but it's in a different form because you don't have that actual line of defense with the shield. Anyways, can we contest them? Can we force them into overtime again? I sure hope so, because we need to figure that out soon. <laughs> okay, there we go. Go this way. Okay, I got a couple of people there before they took me out. That's nice, but I need my team to sort of follow suit with that. I can take out a couple of people, but can I? I guess we're about to find out. Will they take this point? It's in overtime again. Deja vu. Maybe this time we can push him out. Ready? Launch that right down like that. I got somebody at least a little bit, so that's nice. I'm just gonna go for it. Oh, I can't even see what's happening. Okay. Gonna slam on somebody. I see a chopper. And I totally missed him again, darn. See, definitely, once again, it seems like it's easier when you don't charge at all, like when you charge as little as possible. Okay, gotcha. Then I missed them all right there. <laughs> I gotta charge a little bit. That's not what I wanted to do. Ooh. But basically, once you get them in your combo, it could be hard for them to get out, it seems. But that's the tough part, is getting them in your combo. It's crazy, whoa, whoa, what is happening? Get back here. Ah, oh, I missed him. Darn, so he's probably gonna get me here. Well, maybe, maybe I can at least get away. All right, charge up. No, charge, please, charge. Sometimes it's so weird, because I'm trying to charge, and it immediately, like, lets it rip. So, once again, it just takes some time to figure out what in the world's going on. They are so close to capturing the point, but I don't want them to do it. <laughs> Come on, we can stop them, I know we can. Oh boy. Okay, plant right there, boom. We got him, we got him. Okay, they weren't actually there anymore. But lots of small enemies are definitely like a tough spot for this. Oh. I'm gonna get you, how did that not get you? Like we really like ran into you and it just pushed us over to the side. That's not fair. Oh, okay, we got rid of the rose there. Ah, oh, and I think the blue blazes got us. It's so tough, but we're now reaching 40 vanquishes. That's crazy. All right, well, they did end up getting the point. That stinks, we'll just keep it going. Defend the master switch. I think we can do this out of the three or four times I've gotten to this point in this map. I think the zombies have won all but once, so. I'm expecting the zombies to win this one, especially with how close everything has been. You don't see me. So I'm going to hope I don't totally miss, but look at me, totally missing. Oh no. Oh no. All right, they, they keep the upgrade like that. There's really not much I can do about it, except for foolishly just charge, and I just can't see a single thing. <laughs> oh my gosh. But I, I will definitely try to practice with this, get some more work in with it. But like when it comes to rating it, compared to some of the other legendary upgrades, how would I rate it? I think that my favorite one is probably the scientist one. It is the easiest to learn, it is the most effective. The scientist, followed by the Colonel Corn, followed by the, oh. 
I think maybe the Rose and the Super Brains one are tied for last place. And I feel like last place gives it a bad sound to it, but it's not a bad ability. It's just the other, the Super Brains one and the, gotcha. Um, and the Kernel Corn one are just really good. And like the Rose one's good too. It's just out of the three, it was definitely the most difficult to sort of use and make the most of. Um, and with that being said, this one, is just the most difficult to figure out. Once again, we're glowing green, and I don't know what that means. Oh my gosh. And you really gotta make yourself not known, because if they see you, they're gonna take you out before you're even able to charge. There is definitely an element of surprise. And did they just win? I think they did. Not yet? Almost. Come on, let's get back out there. I'm just gonna hop over. Just like that. Okay, we pushed it back over to a better area. That's at least good. And now I'm a goat. How many times is that gonna happen today? Okay, just gonna keep pushing it. Okay, that's good. It's really nice against, if you can get better at landing it. I can imagine it'd be really nice simply because you can one hit a nightcap or an acorn. Thank you. Okay. There we go. And then once you get it better to combo up with everything, it just gets better and better and better. Anyways, uh, we're just gonna keep going. I think we could, once again, we could win this, but will we? That's the question. They're trying to turn it to daytime. They have three minutes to do so. I'll do everything I can to stop them. Uh, where are they? Okay, wait, was there a chomper? There is a chomper and I went right through him again. You gotta be kidding me. I'm just gonna leave him be. He's not really helping or hurting their team at this point. Ooh. That's not gonna get you. It just, they really, really tear into you if you give them the chance. And that's sort of the biggest problem with it, is that you're such a big target as it is as a Super Brains, and you have to put yourself in a very vulnerable spot. So it's definitely this risk over reward gambling that you're constantly doing when you're playing this, and that's really cool for sure. And it makes me think, like, what other cool ideas could they think of for some of the other characters that hopefully we end up seeing soon? I don't want to be a goat way up here in the air. Goats can't fly as far as I understand. I mean, I guess the hover goat can. I mean, is hovering flying? I think that's like an eye of the beholder kind of thing. Oh. Here we go. You're in trouble. Yeah, I told you you were in trouble, and guess what? You were in trouble. Oh, who's next? Uh, well, right now, all that's happening is everybody's firing at me, so... Seems like I'm next. <laughs> oh, there we go. Nice. Oh, there, they're okay. Oh, come on, almost gotcha. I need to start healing up here. Go for you. No, <laughs> who hit me there? Oh my gosh, that hurt. And there's not even anybody over there yet at this point. Quickly, Dr. Heals, help me. It's my best bet. I hear a chomper, now I see a chomper. Oh, we got somebody with that. It does make for a really useful escape though, that's for sure. Oh, ho, ho, ho. and for the ones that don't expect it, oh boy, it's great. Ah, oh, darn, I was hoping I could at least throw out the Super Ultra Ball there before I got vanquished, but we're over 50 vanquishes in this round now. Isn't that good? And they're still trying to push it. I don't think they're going to be able to do this and I don't think this is one that falls into overtime. I think when the minute's up, it's gonna be up. So we'll find out. Let's just launch over like that, though. And I just really wanna give them as hard of a time as I can. That Colonel Corn's jumping around, but once again, that's not gonna help them push this forward. Oh no. Ooh. Okay, charge back in. I missed. How embarrassing. I'm just trying so hard to get him. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, I got nothing done that, that time. That is just awful. But once again, that's the risk you run when you're charging in like that. But there's 15 seconds remaining. They haven't even gotten halfway through as far as I can tell. Yeah, the meter's sort of weird like that, but we're actually pushing it back right now, it seems. Okay, that didn't do too much. This is definitely one of the weirdest endings to a 
Oh my gosh, that was a bad idea. One of the weirdest endings to a turf takeover map. It's, it's just hard to sort of understand what to do. I think you have to stand on the top of it to push it around, but it just gets weird. Anyways, there is an overtime. That's just sort of been the name of the episode, overtime. Constantly. Well, let's see. Third time's the charm, right? We failed the first two overtimes. Will we fail the third one? I did some damage out, that's looks nice. Okay, come on, get you out of here. Please. Okay, that was much better. And did we win? I guess we won. So there is that done. Zombies win, third time was the charm, and I get a double vanquish to finish everything off. Fantastic, okay, so it was a lot of fun, even if it was difficult, but there we go, there was a good look at the um, new Super Brains ability that I obviously have forgotten the name of. So there was a look at the legendary costume, the metalhead for the Super Brains, as well as that legendary ability, which was very interesting, very amazing. It, of course, was the Brainium Basher 9001. Let me know your thoughts on both of those, and if you wanna see more action with it, stay tuned, because like I said, in an upcoming episode, we'll be showcasing the other legendary outfit, the Midas Tough, for the Super Brains as well. But next episode, we'll be doing the Space Cadet Challenges. I'm looking forward to those. But for right now, that is gonna wrap it up for today's episode of Plants vs. Zombies Battle for Neighborville. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.